excretion can simply be in three forms that is it could be excreted as ammonia urea or uric acid so when i say ammonia that means it is the most toxic form it is usually seen in lower order organisms uh, where the excretion takes place either by diffusion or by skin or by gills so those are the methods through which actually excretion takes place and the product of excretion is ammonia now this is usually seen in amph uh, the amphibians the aquatic animals and the bony fishes however in higher order organisms the form of excretion changes into urea and this urea is relatively less toxic so it is seen in mammals terrestrial uh, amphibians and marine fishes so the important difference is here we have marine fishes where ureotelic Uh, excretion occurs that is excretion as urea however in bony fishes we have excretion as ammonia and therefore it is known as aminotelic and the last form is the most concentrated form of excretion which is the uric acid and it is in the form of small pellets usually seen in reptiles birds insects and snails so those are the common creatures under which excretion occurs as uric acid and since it occurs as uric acid it is known as uricotelic so we understood three forms of excretion broadly which is ammonia urea and uric acid ammonia is aminotelic urea is ure uh, ureotelic and uric acid is uricotelic so there is the difference between the three ammonia is the most toxic form usually seen in aquatic animals bony fishes and amphibians ureotelic i repeat again is seen in mammals terrestrial amphibian uh, terrestrial uh, amphibians and marine fishes and uric acid is seen in reptiles birds insects and land snails